Hello, Bronze Leaders. Welcome back to Sonic Cat Plays Adam RPG. Uh, this is episode 16 or 17. Honestly, I don't really keep track until I put the title on the video. We just turned in our quest to let that guy, to let him know that we found Costi the Ob. So his ass is walking down to that town that we found and he's about to get his fucking murder on. So should we go down there and see what happens? Maybe. But right now, we are gonna go to the abandoned factory because we gotta turn in our quest for the Roaring Forest. That I continually called the Rumbling Forest and will probably still do so moving forward, but I'll try not to. Timer started. Notebook ready. So I have this notebook now uh, and I'm trying to write down your guys' tips and then things that I, I see in the game that maybe I need to make notes of later. Uh, and so if you see me writing, that's why. I'm trying to trying to get more involved, you see. So that's what we're doing. Okay, so we need to... Oh man, it's been a while since we've been here. Here's an interesting question. Because I feel like a couple of the... Come on in, buy my stuff. Who are you? Hold on, seriously, who are you? You have a... a you have a... Satan's star on your forehead there except it's not circled but she just carved it into your forehead there um interesting approach wait what hold on i had skipped through that i didn't even see what he said hold on let's do a review i was clicking too fast uh is you know he talks to you first haha <laughs> hello my brother in devil well i mean no just you really admiring my armor aren't we i totally understand i'm proud of it made it myself the man beats himself on the chest. His makeshift armor emits a muffled bassy sound. Ba boom! That's probably not the sound it makes, to be honest. Uh, as if you understand, listen and try to remember. This armor saved my life so many times I've seriously become to believe it's magical. Doesn't look like much. Uh, well, how'd you do it? The man looks at you suspiciously, but then shrugs and dress gestures for you to come closer. He does that at that point. When you know you're busted. I should probably ask you to pay me for this, but I'm too lazy. What does it matter? Anyayoyo. Anyayi. Anyway. You should do good for its own sake, not for sappy gratitude. So, he tells you what resources you'll need, how to bend steel sheets, how to sew leather patches together with a makeshift bone needle, how to tie up seams, and eventually how to make it all work. So I've taught you everything. Now you can craft your own armor too, but remember that you owe me. Sure. Thorny armor. I'm really not impressed, like, at all, with what you've done here, to be frank. I mean, I'm Sonic Cat, but I'll be frank for a second. I do think I need tape, and honestly, I have no idea if we tried to steal from this guy before, so we're just gonna go ahead and... Well. Probably there's just way too many people out here, and we shouldn't be trying to steal from anyone right now, honestly. Oh, he has two of those. Okay, hold on. We're gonna play this smart. We're gonna wait until most people walk away. We're gonna save real quick. I think I've... Tr I'm almost certain that I've... Ooh. Okay, well, we got one. Hey, we'll take it. So it seems like it resets if enough time goes by, honestly. So I may be able to try to re-steal from everyone in this village. Wait here for a moment. I'll give you a shout if, any if I need you. Just stay there by the boxes or whatever. Hey, you stop moving. Stop, 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 stop walking. Fine, you know. Oh, he stopped walking. Okay, again, I don't know uh, if people are going to be real mad at this. Okay, well. Uh, I'm going to wait till he turns around. Wait till this guy walks off. Go literally any direction except look there. Thank you. That's mine. Oh! Okay, well, that second one was not mine. Okay. So we can't steal from that guy again. There's no way that I can steal anything from this guy. Like, I'm fairly positive he's looking right at us, so... Ripple Cologne and some other garbage. Anyway, let's talk. This guy again. So, uh, I've come to report. I've checked out the Roaring Forest and came to an unexpected conclusion. 
As it turns out, the forest rumbles because there's a massive colony of mutant insects digging their tunnels underneath. Dan raises an eyebrow in surprise and immediately calms down in a few moments. Fascinating. So it's because of mutants. Well, that's something new. But this seems more logical than all these other nonsense stories about pre-war equipment and underground trains. It was worth it, though, to find out once and for all what's going on. To put an end to the rumors, no matter how stupid. He takes out a bunch of bills from his bosom and hands it to you. There you go, better late than never, your traveling allowance. 1,300 rubles and all you earned of it because of the last kopeck. To the last kopeck. Unless, of course, you feel like bargaining, in which case I can't guarantee you the payment in full. Understood. Come back tomorrow for a new assignment, but for now you're free to roam. I mean, I've always been free to roam. You don't dare tell me how to live my life. I didn't actually mean to load. Is it this guy? Shishak. Yo, Shishak, you're about to get robbed, my guy. I've come back with way more points. Okay, well. What I meant was, um... Ow. Ow. Way to, way to go, Fidel. I hear you shooting people over there. Top notch. Alright, well, we tried. Pretty sure I stored a bunch of people or stuff in here. Didn't I? I thought for sure I did. One of these. Oh, there we go. Um, We're under our weight. May as well take it. Oh, now we're very close to our weight. Whoops. Yeah, there's nothing else in here. Oh, gunpowder. Hell yeah, I'll take gunpowder. Hell yeah. Uh, okay. So we're all done here. Uh, we should go grab our buddy. Adele, let's go. We didn't really get anything more there, but that's fine. Didn't really uh, expect to, honestly. We are in withdrawal, and that's unfortunate, but we can't really do anything about it. So, what are you gonna do? Uh, at this point, where do we wanna go? Where do we wanna go, guys? I was kinda thinking about Can't get there. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, you can. Oh, you can. If you go all the way around. Ooh, I want to do that. All right, I know what we're doing this episode. We're going to that, um, this, that. We're going to do that. Game saved. How are we doing on health? Meet scavengers. Like meet the parents, but it's the scavengers. What if I tell him to wait there? Do I have a better chance? Does he need to be out, like, hidden somewhere? Oh, this guy is interesting stuff. No, I didn't. I didn't want to do that. I did actually want to try and steal it. Uh, if we were gonna steal anything, that's probably worth a lot. And then we probably want that. Okay. Hey, we at least got that uh, stimulant. I'm sure that's worth something. We're going to sell it right back to him. This guy is a crowbar. Hey, uh, I would like to trade you this. Wow, that's worth a lot of money. Oh, he really doesn't have anything else to... Um... He doesn't have anything else, so let's go. I think it'll grab our companion. Uh, and let's continue on our way. So that battlefield stimulant is worth 500 rubles. Uh, which just means that if we come across traitors, we're gonna buy ammo. Bandits. We're going to hope that they don't have really high-powered weapons. What do we got? I see one guy there. One guy there. One guy there. What do we got? What do we got? 
He has a gun, it looks like. This guy has a knife. All right, so we're just worried about the guy with a gun. Um, Fidel, can we... Fidel? Oh, do I need to talk to him? Does he stay in that... Oh, I see. Okay. So he'll come with you to whatever areas you're going to, but he won't be... He won't be following you yet until you tell him. Here's what we're gonna do, Fidel. We're gonna sneak up behind him. We're not really gonna sneak, and I have no idea how they haven't seen us, like, already, but... Fidel, are you here, buddy? There we go. We are about to wreck these guys. Yeah, get shot by Fidel. The man is a god. Aimed. Uh, let's see. If I do two regular... Yeah, I can do two regular shots. I don't think I'm going to plead for a quick death, honestly. I think you're about to get burst fired and you're about to feel real bad about your life decisions. Oh, just kidding. I'm gonna do it to this guy. Here we go, boys. Get fucked. He is dead. And then I can even get a stabby stab on this guy. Hold on. Stab. Yeah. Ah, okay. I mean, stop. Stop. Oh, buddy, your ass is about to get stabbed a whole bunch more. Yeah, what do you got? Zero damage. Two damage. You got nothing. Your buddy over there with the knife? Doesn't even matter. Get shot. Yeah, that's Fidel. Don't you forget his name. It's Fidel, if you were wondering. Uh, I can't hit that guy. Ah, it's a decent chance. Hey, look at that. 12 damage. I'm definitely just going to stab him to death because I don't want to waste the ammo. Oh, missed. Missed. You suck. Bandit sucks. Ah, oh, get dicked. Bandit sucks. Wow, this guy had a lot of stuff. Thorny armor. Whoa, he had a cast iron shield? That's rad. He had bullets? He had all kinds of crap. Just take it all. It belongs to us now. You cannot proceed with overloaded inventory. Yeah, well. Go ahead and eat that. Then. Then. Go ahead and eat that. Now our hunger is zero. We're good there. He can hold a lot more stuff. So let's go ahead and give him a lot more stuff. Uh, how close so we can get rid of that? Hold that. Uh, I'm encumbered, but I think we can get out of being encumbered. On the road again, murdering bandits. That went very well. I saved. We're gonna walk around Paragon. Wait, there was a dog lady. I think I was supposed to talk to the dog lady in Paragon for that quest. Friendly junk scavengers. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, where are they? Hello. Hel hello. I'm gonna have my buddy. Actually, you know what? I don't actually. It's gonna take too long to have him, like, stand by himself and... It would be nice if there was a quick button. Wow. Okay, well, we just stole pretty much everything from that guy. Okay, well, getting better at stealing. I think uh, next level, I do think we're going to up our um, stealth. We're going to up our stealth by probably quite a few points. Someone told... Oh, God, I forget because I didn't write it down. But someone had commented that I only needed like 80 in a particular stat. What was it? Maybe it was lockpicking. I definitely do need to up lockpicking. Maybe that's what I'll do. Just a ton of points in lockpicking. Do we want to go talk to the dog lady? I don't think we want to talk to the dog lady. Not right now. Maybe on our way back. I'm really just interested in getting to whatever this... Oh! <gasps> 
Wolves. Are these the crazy kill you instantly wolves or the wolves that we can actually like stand a chance against? Uh oh, was gonna reload my gun. Fidel just took 31 crit damage in the eyeball. Fuck you, wolf. That fight went sour real quick. Was not prepared for Fidel to take like a million damage in the eyeball. You always think you're prepared until you take 31 crit damage in the eyeball. What am I supposed to do about that? I don't know. Oh my goodness. Uh, by the way, today's tea brought to you by a Psalm black tea. There's a small hair in my cup. I've diffused the situation. Hair removed. Oh, we're in combat right away. Hey man, it's your guys' funeral. My boy Fidel has a shield. Ah, he missed. Well, he has a shield anyway. So be afraid, because he has a shield and stuff. I mean, y'all are just getting stabbed to death. Um, because this fight's not gonna be interesting, probably just gonna cut to the end of it, and then we'll go explore that, that, uh, cave area, okay? Boom, be right back. Okay, welcome back, guys. I finished the fight, I looted a bunch of stuff, but now we have way too much... Uh, we have way too much... Well, not way too much. I had to trade a bunch of it off. Better. Oh, I'm poisoned. Eh, terrific. Uh, let's see, I could use that, the wolf antidote. I mean, I may as well. Minus one personality, but that's fine. I also removed the shield from Fidel, just because, uh, it really dropped his strength down. And I don't think it was really worth it, to be honest. EBH. Let's go ahead and loot this real quick. I may cut to the end of this as well. Uh, I think what I'm going to start doing, guys, is when I get into these little caves and stuff, I'm just going to cut to the end and tell you what we got. Because it's just, I feel like it's, there's no reason that I need to have all of this on, um, on film. Just because it feels like a waste of your time, you know? You kind of know what these caves are like by now. And as long as there's no actual combat, it's not really, you know, terribly interesting. Um, so yeah, I may start doing that just so we can get through more of these. Um, today I'm probably gonna try to record three or four of these episodes back to back. I don't think they're all gonna come out, uh, at the same time or anything. But, I feel like we need to make more progress, and so I'm gonna have to cut some of just, like, like that whole encounter, right? That probably took me five or seven minutes. But there's no reason that I need to have five or seven minutes of a combat that you know I'm gonna win. You, well, <laughs> mostly. Uh, and it's just against a bunch of insects. Like, you know how that's gonna go. I take zero damage often from their hits. It's just not interesting. Wolf pack. This is a more serious one. This is a more serious one. Can we get a stab in as well? Takes four, no, 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 just a regular stab. Almost dead. Five damage. 20 in the eye? Fucking blinded? Fidel, man, buddy. Missed. Nine damage. Fidel, I need you. But he's blind, of course. Oh, you have literally no health. Fidel gulps for air with difficulty. He waves at you tiredly. How you feeling, buddy? He has one HP. If, if I don't get a treatment, there's soon gonna be one less Fidel in the world. Perfect. He's back to full. I'm real sorry, buddy. That's, that's my bad. Wow, so wolves, still tough. Wolves are still tough. Oh, wait, we can cook something. Uh, let's mix some coffee. 
Let's do that. Uh, warm up some canned meat. There we go. Perfect. Excellent. Done. Now we got an extra strength. There's another wolf. Oh, no. Oh, no. Fidel, feel free to just open fire on this dude. Missed. One damage. All right, my gun just does very little damage to this guy. That was weird. We are so close to... No, we're actually... Oh, right, because we got the extra one strength. Does that mean there might be another wolf here? What is that? It's like a dead creature. Okay, well... All right, we're done here. Um, not a, not a lot of EXP. Uh, how are we do Actually, we're real close to a level. Couple more random encounters like that, we'll have our next level. And that does mean that we're gonna be able to get a perk. Yeah, we'll be able to get the first blood. The first punch is always critical. Ooh, wolves, okay. I don't really like fighting wolves, to be honest. Opening miss is not the way to go. 22 damage. Well, I guess we'll go for a second follow-up shot. Eight damage. Missed. Fidel, I'm gonna need you. Ooh, this could be real bad. Oh, knocked down. Terrific. Five damage. Six damage. Dead damage. Seven damage? Jesus Christ. Injured. Oh, I have no ammo. Okay, well, we can do a burst shot. Uh, save. He is almost dead. Wolves are fucking mean. 27 crit damage, instant death. So far, we're okay. But not if we get knocked down. Not if we get knocked down. If we get knocked down, it's, it's over. It's super over. And there goes Fidel. I think, honestly, the chances for you to be knocked down are way too high. Way too high. I need you to get up, buddy. Like, really need you to get up. Oh, buddy. He's gonna die. Oh, he stood up. He's almost dead, though. He is almost dead. What does our reload take? Two? May as well reload. Please don't get knocked down again. Ah! Ah! Really? Can you attack me instead? Is that possible? Yeah, I mean, it is possible. Okay, well, if we can just live... Injured. I don't think we can kill it before I die. Okay, well, we're drugged now, so that's... And we're addicted. It's just a never-ending cycle.
I really don't think we're ever gonna be not addicted or drugged. And we're also encumbered. May as well just take all the meat. I mean, we're already way over. Is there a campfire here? Nah, that would be really nice though. We're encumbered, drugged, and addicted. Excellent. Let's go ahead. Oh, if we eat that, we're gonna get toxic. <laughs> toxic. Wow. These give very little health, but whatever. Eat some crackers. We're almost dead, so we're just gonna eat some crackers. Oh, I'm sorry, they're biscuits. Uh, what was the healing powder? We do actually have everything. Failed. Okay, well, we tried. We need more tea, I guess. He's not feeling great, but we'll get through. Game saved. Huh. That was almost tragic. Almost forgot to save. The Whoa, this is a weird new layout. All right. All the music is gone. Kind of makes me nervous. But it seems like there's nothing in here. At least nothing that's going to attempt to kill me. Encumbered a single bullet? Oh. Oh, we're both just so at our limit right now because we have so much crap. Okay, take some empty water bottles. So basically, if I pick up literally anything, uh, it's going to be too much. Good to know. Uh, in your comments, it was funny, too, because uh, I had been, you know, asking the question a couple of times, like, what happens if I just murder, you know, an entire caravan? Like, why don't I just steal all their shit? And some of you were like, don't do that. Do not do that. And I was like, okay, yeah, well, it's a good thing I didn't. So we're probably going to avoid fighting any more wolves for, like, the immediate future. Uh, our episode is about at time here. And it does look like there's a lot to explore here. There's a security camera that has power. That's interesting. Okay, so we're gonna wrap up here. Next episode, we'll be exploring whatever the hell this is. There's an entrance and they have a, a they have power and security cameras. That's interesting. So we're gonna wrap up here. Let me know in the comments below what you guys are thinking. Uh, if you have any new ideas. By the way, I did want to mention this. I don't know how close to the end of the game we're at. I don't think we're that close, but it will be coming up at some point. So, for all you guys who are watching these Adam videos, and I super appreciate it, what do you guys want to see me play next? I gotta get moving on my next game here. We gotta keep this train moving forward. So, if you guys have an idea of what I should play next, maybe it's a newer game, maybe it's an older game, maybe we can all come to a consensus. Maybe I should do like a vote or something, I don't know. You have an idea though, leave it in the comments down below. Let me know what you're thinking. That'll be very helpful. Uh, until then though, I'm gonna end this episode here and start recording another one right away because I need to keep playing this today. I got that itch, you know? And not, not like that kind of itch, but the game itch, right? Okay, anyway, see you guys next time. Stay bronze, everybody.